Hello, everybody, and welcome to the return of PUBG for New Show Plus. I am Ben Hansen from Minmax, joined by Leo Vader. It's back. PUBG's back, baby. Don't try and hide. It's sweeping the nation, nay, the world. Ain't that right, Leo? Um, PUBG has never been hotter. <laughs> so we are checking out PUBG. We have not played in years and years, but this is all because you voted for this option for New Show Plus. Every single week, we let our Patreon supporters vote for which new show we create or continue with New Show Plus. This week, it was close. State of Decay was right there, Leo, but people wanted us to return to PUBG and apparently to see the big banner on the back of the plane that says Black Black Pink, Pink is here. All right, so if anybody knows what Blackpink is, please let us know in the chat here on Twitch. <laughs> we appreciate it. K-pop group. Oh my God. I don't know why there's an, a banner ad for them, so to speak. Uh, hey, Leo, you gotta, yeah. you gotta ask the question, baby. Where are we dropping? Where are we dropping? Where, Where we are we dropping? dropping? Maybe school. <laughs> Maybe school. <laughs> I don't think there's a school on this map, actually. All right, I put a little, I put a little pin on that map there for you, Leo. Let's go southwest of Lakawi, if that works for you. I vacation there every year. Okay, great. I, uh, I. I'm dropping. Oh crap! Okay, okay, I'm going to. Go for the trap. It has been a long time. Like I put in 80 hours in this game back in 2017, but you were just saying that you're looking at your stats, and before we started, you. We're starting to tell an interesting anecdote, and I said, cool it, mister, save that. <laughs> yeah, I'm like 120 hours in this game, but yeah, noticing it's all early, early days. Like, this game has seasons, and you can look at your stats back to season one, but even season one I have done nothing in, because my love affair with this game was before it even got seasons. That was before the concept of seasons existed. Like, TV shows used to just be one long stretch with no break for anybody. That's right, it would air in a row. Mm -hmm. That was the original binging. <laughs> uh, I think there's somebody near me. Good. I'm counting on it. And there's a truck already, so I think it's like NPC driven or somebody landed fast. The hell? Are there NPC trucks? I don't know. Maybe somebody just landed early and got in a truck. I think that's probably more likely. Oh, boy. All right. Um, this is a fun way to learn everything that's changed. Yeah. Just boots on the ground style. All right, everybody. Uh, we're wide open to tips. If anybody wants to throw something out there. Uh, I am not. Oh, okay. So if you just have any advice for me, I will take that. But Leo's kind of on a one-man mission. He said, we're not going to stop streaming till we get that chicken dinner, which seemed aggressive. I said chicky din din, and I'll thank <laughs> you to respect that. <laughs> Leo! I'm coming. Leo, I'm murdering a bot right now. <laughs> <laughs> There's no way that was a human. There's just <laughs> no way. I know you're in denial. You've taken your first life. It doesn't feel real. <laughs> Leo, can you check that thing's pulse or like can we cut it open or do anything just to confirm that it is not an actual human? Oh my god. Okay. Oh, there's a human in the road. Human in the road. Are you kidding me? Running. Bot style straight down the middle. Oh, we have buddies. Nefarious Blacks on our team? Yeah. Interesting. Okay, I'm just gonna well, it's time too far to hit him with what I got. I'm gonna go across the street. Okay, still trying to understand my weapons, but okay, okay. I'm coming, Leo. They shoot. They shoot out the front, okay. Hey, Leo, I'm so glad we're playing this and not playing Avengers right now. <laughs> not that there's anything wrong with that. No, I see the appeal. A car again. If you hear that? Oh, that's our friend! <gasps> Can we get in? Friend with car, perhaps. Friend with car. All right, let's just go hang out with Donnie Darko and these guys. Friend they seem with cool. car. I think I posted that on Craigslist recently. I am friend with car. <laughs> <laughs> hang out with me. It's so weird seeing, like, just costumes. Like, back... Back when I played this game, it was still somewhat grounded. Yeah, we saw a creepy clown in the lobby, of all things. Oh my god, are you kidding Of all me? places to see a creepy clown. Okay, genuinely still trying to understand. Okay, just, I got, I got my three guns. Oh, 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 
It's just a teammate. It's just Leo. It's just Leo. It's just me. It's just me, your friend. Chat, you may tell me how to aim down sights. Oh, they've got a rocket launcher over here if you want it. I don't know if I can be trusted with that. Okay. Oh. Is it, uh... Isn't it just right-click, Leo? Well, that's like zoom in, but I don't know if there's an actual aim down sights button. Mm. I mean, oh, right, -click right click once. Yeah, tap it. Thank yeah, you. Yeah, yeah. You King Prometheus. Thank you, everybody. Is anybody still playing this? Let us know in the chat or anywhere <laughs> else you want. I think I will. Uh, you know what? I'm going to get rid of my little baby pistol. Okay. Okay, boy. All right, so then. Uh, boy. Brian, boy, the tension. It's palpable. I'm going to stick with Donnie. Okay. Okay, forgive me, everybody, trying to remember these controls. Okay, here we go. Simple one, two, and three. That's all that's going on here. I feel good about getting the helmet. Um, I feel good about this kind of village that we're living in. Um, I'm amazed that our teammates are not pushing hard for us to go a certain direction. They seem pretty cool with us basically doing nothing. Um, I'm impressed. Yeah, overall. we're kind of all on the same page here, and that's lovely to see in its squad. Let's, uh, you want to head up to the northeast here? Yeah, I'm going with Nefarious over here. I, think I thought we were kind of like a little team within this team, Leo, but if you like Nefarious, I want you to be happy. I want us to both go with Nefarious, to be okay. clear of my intention. Okay. Yeah, I think Nefarious is definitely the ringleader here. Yeah. Even though there's a three above his head and a one above yours. Right, right. I just feel like he's more trustworthy. And I know that from personal inside experience. Uh, we got a level two helmet over here. Oh, I see you already got one, Leo. You need Not nothing. Wasn't going to brag. Oh my god. Uh, is Donny Darko in a fight? Yeah, it sounds like it. We gotta go help our boy! Donny! Donny! I'll throw Great movie. my helmet. In honor of your movie, we'll defend you! Okay, Leo, don't worry. I got a little, I got a little trick up my sleeve, and it's called One Rocket Launcher. <laughs> One is enough. Do you think they're still down there? I mean, he seems scared as hell. He's ADSing. That's all I know. It looks like he's IBSing too with how scared he is, if you know what I mean. <laughs> True, man. Luckily, we don't know fear yet. We're just rookie soldiers out here. Yet to experience it. Okay. What's your plan here, Leo? Don't walk me through it. Walk me through it. Well, Donnie's covering the flank on the right side. Oh! They're up in me! They're up in me! They're up on the hill! On yonder hill! Oh my god, I can see the whites of their eyes. Uh, if you can get up to my bush, Leo, I'd appreciate it. Okay. Oh, oh my god. They're behind the trees! Of course! Of course! Leo. Well, I'm sure they have. Can you crawl towards me? Well, <laughs> I was I was trying to crawl towards them. I thought it'd make for a better stream, more action. Um, <laughs> you gotta show you're willing to join them. <laughs> Did they die from your I hands? I think so. Donnie, we came for you. Now who has come for me? Oh, thank you. Thank you, Nefarious Black. Interesting, Leo. Interesting who gets to me first. <laughs> I'm covering you. It's very important work. Okay, let's get the hell out of here, huh? Um, now, is do there appeals? Uh, yeah, I think I do. Is there a reason that uh, I wouldn't be able to? Okay, if you're that damaged, you just can't run. Is that the idea? I'm trying to remember the basics here, because I was. Maybe you're too scared. I'm trying to get this uh, car and get the whole crew out of here. Okay. Um, That's my I, goal now. I cannot... How you say, uh, run? Or <laughs> walk briskly? That's normal. Are you serious? No. 
Leo, am I, am I gonna die here, man? Alright, I'll just get in your car and then we'll be set. If anybody in the chat can think of a reason why I would not be able to really do anything here. Oh, you're healed up a bit now. Yeah, you wouldn't think that. You were. Oh, do you probably pressed your like walk button? Press Alt, maybe. Oh. Or is it? Control? Definitely get in the car. Okay, I guess I'll get in the car. Yeah, I think I pressed Control. Thank you, Leo. Jeez. No problem. All right, there we go. Ooh, rival car. Up on the hill, cooler than ours. Wait, where are they? At? They're like forward left. I don't know if our teammates on. Okay. Well, they better keep walking. This is going to be bad news if we see him again. For them, that is. <gasps> oh my god. <laughs> um, Alright. Take your time. Here we go. <laughs> Let's just hopefully go around this tree. Just, we like uh, dancing with the blue. God, I feel like that... Was the wall that blue before? That map is That's a very blue wall. <laughs> this is news to me. It sounds like we're just co- did he just idle down that hill? To save gas? I don't know. We thought like the guys, engine turned off. Yeah, we thought these guys were rookies. They might be the secret champs here. I hope so. Or maybe I wonder if that orange car was the team we were fighting, getting away from the circle, or if they died out there. God, I hope they accidentally drove into the circle. There's always a Quote chance, unquote, right? fighting. <laughs> Being scared <laughs> of together. Okay, now this... This shall be <laughs> the new home. Uh -huh. These guys are really, okay. really good. Uh huh. And now, okay, it's F to get out, of course. Goodbye, car. Off into the jungle. We hardly knew ye. People have definitely been here. I don't know if they're still here. Honestly, Leo, this is, uh. I thought this game would be full obnoxious garbage at this point, but I'm glad to see there's still tension allowed in a Battle Royale game these days. It feels pretty classic. Yeah. Um, alright. I am eager... I'm even still getting scared of your guys' footsteps. Right! That's a good sign, I think. Do you want to try and move into this Paradise Resort, see if we can find some good stuff? Let's do it. Okay. Seems like this place has been cleared. Alright. <laughs> And we're outside the circle again. Yeah. The car has probably rolled its way all the way back to the circle. Which is a pretty good sign. Uh, hey, chat. Hey, chat, we were talking. Oh, 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 car, 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 car. Oh, careful, we're not with you. Oh, they're fine. They didn't suspect a freaking thing, these these morons. Um, But we're talking next week. If people vote for uh, PUBG to come back again, the second return, uh, it'd be fun to get a full custom game going with MinMax community folks. Because I assume everybody owns this game. We just like put a call out on Twitter and stuff. It'd be fun to get a full, full MinMax match here. Oh yeah. And, and we're just gonna feel confident that no one will ever stream snipe us. We're unstream snipeable. Right, right. Because we move like water. How are things looking up there, my man? See, there's an elephant statue. It looks pretty cool. Um, I like the little carts, but it's quiet. But you know what they say. Quiet, just right. That's right. <laughs> okay. Quiet. Comfortingly quiet. <laughs> uh, oh, attachments and stuff. That's a thing. Okay. I'll put that on the old M4. How's the game volume, everybody? Do you want us to turn it up? Oh, there are 33 people left alive, by the way. Sorry, yeah, I guess we're our absolutely are back. crushing it. Yeah, this is absurd. I think we're kind of coasting on my one kill, but you know what? I'm not here to point fingers at myself. <laughs> Everyone's been scared of us since then. <laughs> That's right. Uh, there's an M4 over here if you don't have one, Leo. I just dropped it, actually. <laughs> That's you looking at mine. Oh. <laughs> so you're, like, saying you're too good for an M4? Yeah. What do you got? What are you packing? Shot Southwest! I've got a new gun I've never seen before called the QBU. Hmm. It's a marksman rifle, and I've got the S12K, the automatic shotgun. 
Not that it's any of your business. <laughs> this one is kind of funky. I remember when the Joker from Suicide Squad, the trailer took place here, I think. Yes, that's right. It's a little bit of history for you. Yeah, when the Joker showed us the, the ins and outs of this map. Oh, hello, level if three If you've backpack. got healing, make sure to use it. I tell myself as well as you. Um, I do not, so if you see any, I'd love it. I wonder what our buddies are doing. A little extra for you. That's really weird that... Um... Oh, the circle's here! Hello! Uh, it's really weird duos is only jammer pack. I think a jammer pack is. Jam UAVs or something? Hmm. Um, but it's weird that duos are only first person. I wonder why that would be. I mean, yeah, modes are always rotating. I imagine it's just happens to be when we're playing it. Yeah. Uh, all right, I'm starting to head out with Donnie Darko here. Right behind ya. Uh, Warpipe says, Matrix 4 trailer on Thursday. Am I the only one who's excited? No, I am very, very excited for that, but I didn't even watch this. Ah! <laughs> that was so jarring. Okay, Leo. I watched Johnny Darko get his butt shot up. It wasn't great. Uh, Nefarious Black seems to be charging in like he owns the place. Yeah, we're, the, we're gonna have to. The wall's about to close again. Okay. I wonder, did Nefarious Black take him out? He's on the supply drop right now. Oh, God. That has to be. They're just... probably camping. It is probably how they spotted us. Yeah. Because right. we were doing everything right. Right. We're basically the perfect team. It's basically SEAL Team 6 here. 2.0. Yeah, no kidding. Except we would have taken down... All of Al Qaeda wouldn't have just stopped at Bin Laden. <laughs> True. Is there one mistake? Okay. Uh, but yeah, I'm really excited about the Matrix, but I didn't watch the teaser because I want to watch that full trailer and let it wash over me. And then just keep in mind, I'm not trying to be a cynical guy here, but I think our peak excitement for Matrix 4 is going to be this trailer. <laughs> and then we're going to watch the movie and be like, what? What are they doing? What's this? And probably be disappointed in some things, but everybody enjoy that trailer. That's my attitude, Leo. It's a gender flipped reboot, right? Ooh, I don't know. Don't tell me. Don't tell me. I genuinely don't know. There must be people here. The sounds I'm hearing, or maybe that's suppressed fire from far away. I don't know. Uh, yeah, that wall's coming up quick though, but you seem to be on top of it. Yeah, let's keep moving. All right, I'm Ooh. just going to run over to these little houses here. People are getting trapped in the in oh, the fog. Good. But I think we're moving up behind a team that's in another fight, which is what you want to do. That's right. That's right. I'm going to follow you, Leo, because we're buddies to the end here. Okay. 18 people left. 18 bots left. Car. Where is this weirdo? Someone's hot dogging it with some tricks. Oh my god. What do you see, Leo? I'm listening. I don't see anything yet. I'm right behind somebody. Got him. Nice! Coming in. If you promise the coast is clear, I'm gonna come in. I promise. Okay, coming in the house. I'm on the taco. What the? Oh. What's happening? I heard something loud and scary. He said something about a taco? <laughs> right. Is that, is that code? I'm hopping outside. Okay. Uh, oh, are our buddies dying back there? Looks like they're all yeah. dying. Yeah. I'm hearing their chat and it's the loudest thing I've ever heard in my life. Yeah, same here. Leo! God! Damn it, I'm hurt real badly. I'm dead. Oh my god. <laughs> Chat says those poor teammates. All right, Leo, it's all on you, buddy. Fairies Black's in a bad spot. All right, Leo. Win one for us, man. 
I'm going for it. There are 11 people left. Yeah, Leo! Oh! I am worthy. Boy! Look at that. All right. Leo, get out of that. Yep. <laughs> Leo likes to just have one little kiss for the blue wall, and then he moves on. And he also likes to stand... Just right out in the open. <laughs> proudly, kind of like slowly it. panting. <gasps> They don't deserve this kill, Leo. They don't deserve this kill, man. It's pissing me off that they even are trying. I know. Oh! Okay. <laughs> Good try. Oh, thanks, man. I it turned chat completely off and still heard it. <laughs> I, I did too, I thought. All right. Should we, should we watch the end of the game? Sure. All right. Uh, I'm watching JV77. Do you want to pick a favorite? Yeah. Oh, I can only go between these two. That's weird. Oh, it's just the team who killed you, I think, is how it normally goes. Oh, okay. Gotcha. Oh, boy. All right. Yeah. All right, I'll watch a Doom Shooter. These guys, yeah. They're, they're moving like experts. Honestly, I think we should hold our head up. We weren't immediately annihilated. No, you got a kill? Yeah. We barely saw I any got two action, kills, but, but who's counting? <laughs> 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 this old rat says, hey, Ben and Leo, who's winning? Uh, we are. Thanks for joining us on the stream, this old rat. I'm just playing my JV77 self. I'm feeling pretty good about my odds here. <laughs> oh. Get out of oh, there. Oh, boy. Get out of there. All about positioning in the late game. <laughs> These guys had to leave their house and now they're dying. Get <clears throat> back in the house, y'all. <clears throat> oh no. Oh. Doing. This is a weird final spot. Right on the edge of that bridge. Yeah, this guy's got a great setup for this though. Yeah. And really hitting those shots like you or I. <laughs> All right, he'll take out a whole tree if he has to. Okay. Go under the bridge. It's safe down He knows there. there's more than just these two guys, though. He is smart. He is smart. You can't take He's that level 314. Oh! Oi! Not Loser. smart enough. We always hated him. <laughs> <laughs> All right, now this guy, though, Al Snipe. Look at that banner. Oh my gosh. Finger point what? right This is a three-person squad and there's four alive, so. <laughs> oh boy. This will end soon. Yeah. Where is the last person hiding? Just under one leaf? Must be. Oh, they saw that. Are they hiding in the blue? They're rolling in the deep? Thank you. Yes. Oh, <laughs> no. Wait, that wasn't it? Okay. He saw a Molotov come out of nowhere. <laughs> he shot where it must have come from. <laughs> All right. Hey, right, PUBG. We know right, PUBG. you. We recognize you still. You're like an old friend, and you haven't changed that much. Just like, yeah, you got a new job, and you're dating somebody weird now who's really into microtransactions. But <laughs> other than that, like, we got you. It definitely feels like we are playing the first Battle Royale. <laughs> you know? Obviously, it's not really, but it, you know what I mean when I say that. Right, right. And But because it's my favorite Battle Royale, uh, I, I really like Blackout. Maybe I like, eh. No, I think this is still probably my favorite, but... Yeah, uh, because a soft of that, spot in yeah, your heart for it. Yeah, I'm a bit of a nostalgic lad, Leo. It's nice. Um, all right, I'm going to turn voice chat. Oops. It won't help. <laughs> really? I turned, I turned it to off and still got them loud and clear. At least they were pleasant. Just yeah. screaming that we weren't paying attention when they were dying a horrible, horrible death. They were oh. just too loud. Okay, Leo, let's do that, um, uh, you know, the one thing. Two-man squad. Two-man squad. And Two -man Tago. Squad. Oh, so it's a small map with a 1980s theme. All right, oh. let's go for Tago here. Cold War. It's all the rage. People are demanding we get one with China. 
they want to play them, they want to talk about them, it's everything. It's everything. I think my favorite battle royale is Apex Legends. When all the dust has settled. Really? That's interesting. I think gun to my head, you have to play a battle royale right now, that's the one I'm picking. By the way, did you uh, G up here? No, that, was, that muscle is uh, <laughs> not been flexed. <laughs> Yeah, I mean, did you play a lot at launch, or what's the the arc of your history with Apex Legends here? Played a lot at launch. Every like four seasons, I get back into it, probably. Huh. What is it about? Because it's a matter of like getting friends who also want to get into it. Right, right. But it still just feels and so good to play. It just, yeah, it feels great. Really snappy. The equipping of attachments and stuff, which I noticed this time, we didn't have to manually equip any attachments to our guns. I did for one. I just right clicked on it and it popped it over there. But like the, oh. the weird thing is the um, the sight automatically attached. So right. I don't know what's the difference between different attachments here. There's something going on. Yeah, that's all we know. <laughs> yeah, I'm a fan. I'm a fan of like low key ability interplay, like abilities that don't insta kill you, but interact with each other interestingly. Right, right. I like that. Yeah. And it's three person squads is a, is a good sweet spot for a battle royale for sure. I think Where so. The too. Fights are have some scale to them, but they're not like hard to track down everybody. Right, right. It's really weird how like game design can affect friendships in that way. Of just like oh, the size of the squad will directly determine if you have to choose which of your friends you like the most and outcast yeah. somebody if you used to play a lot of four person squads with them. <laughs> I guess we gotta vote out. Right. Brian. <laughs> but it has to be that way, man, for the sake of the game design. There's no other way around it. Yeah. Uh, uh, let's see. Uh, Aaron J. Bear asks, are y'all icons Tim Schafer and Gabe Newell? You betcha. <laughs> you uh, got it. <laughs> have we not made that clear in this stream? <laughs> uh, a lot of people are definitely with you that Apex is, is the best. How many maps do they got in Apex now? Um, I think, I'm I'm not sure. I think it's just like one that keeps changing. There might be two that it flips between. But oh, okay. It's more like they make big changes each season. Oh, King Prometheus says, Aaron is asking about your your Steam profile pictures in the bottom right of the lobby. Right. Oh, that makes more sense. Which now. mine is me. Yeah. So I don't know whether that's Tim Schafer or Gabe Newell. <laughs> Mine's Orson Welles, so I don't know. <laughs> I don't know if that's Tim Schafer or Gabe Newell. <laughs> but don't get us started on Leo Vader and Orson Welles, because we're very passionate about those two icons. Of equal import <laughs> is what <laughs> the history books have said. I remember there's this interview with Orson Welles once where he was talking about, you know, how sad it was, the state of the movie industry and stuff in the eighties. Because Steven Spielberg bid in an auction like hundreds of thousands or millions of dollars for the for the sled uh, Rosebud uh -huh. from Citizen Kane. But he's like, yeah, he's dropping all this money on the sled. Meanwhile, I cannot make a new movie. Like no one's willing to finance a new film. And it's kind of sad to think about that idea. Of, really? Like he just wants to make a new movie so badly, but too, everybody's too busy being nostalgic. And even Spielberg who could have pushed through and helped Orson Welles get some money for a new movie. It was like, eh. Yeah, but that sled, though, man. That was really good. <laughs> <laughs> right. Yeah, I want to show my guests that. <laughs> what am I going to do? Show my guests your film? Magnificent. Honestly, t didn't live to the age of Kickstarter. He would have killed it. Oh, my God. Absolutely. Or Patreon. Yeah. Orson you Welles is doing prank podcasts. <laughs> do you think there's anything there for, like... In a morbid world, would people pay to, like, hey, we're going to make a movie with Orson Welles' bones. Like, we'll put his hand on the camera. So technically, it'll be like he's making this movie. Do you think people would fund that? <laughs> people would what? Fund that? Fund it. Hmm. Yes. Okay. Like, just, like, what could you do to kind of revive that? Or like, hey, we've cast all of Orson Welles' children in this movie. Just well, honestly, it's like... They are, they can and they will make a CG Orson Welles and yes. synthesize his voice and have right. him be in something. Right, right. And I believe uh, just 
dancing his bones around like a marionette is about, you know, 1% further than that. <laughs> but maybe technology will make it moot. Like, why have bones when you can have skin, as a lot of people like to say. As the saying goes. <laughs> um, um, is, did we do <laughs> first person? <laughs> yeah, Leo, what? Are you not a gamer? Do you not understand the difference here? Um, I don't know what's going on here, Leo. Um, I thought I did two-person squads, didn't I? Are we in it? Um, I think you might have. I mean, I saw, like, two parachutes going next to each other cutely. Okay. Floating away from us. All right, well, I guess we're set then. That's weird. Maybe that was just, like, the featured mode, but not, like, an automatic default or something. Did you just hear that glass shatter? Was that you? Yeah, that was me. I was having a good okay, time. Good. Sorry. More coming. All right. <laughs> did you look out? It sounds fun, man. That was really fun. Oh, I wish I could, like, automatically swap all of the attachments out of this new gun. Do you think it would do that? Do you think this game's smart enough to do that at this point? No. Okay. But that's what we like about I don't it. want it to assume. Well, actually, when you you mean when you're picking up a new gun. Yeah. Would it yeah, swap the Yeah, that would be cool. Instead of losing the attachments. Oh, my gosh. It's M16. Let's see if it does it. Uh, Yeah, it totally does. That's great. Good job. Good job, old game. We're rooting for you. Painkillers. If you got, if you see a backpack, Leo, I could really use that in a big bad way. Come on over to me. Okay, I'm coming through the glass. That's so loud for us to be in different <laughs> settlements. Is, is it <laughs> for me to be able to hear that? Is it possibly coming through like the mixer though? Oh gosh, you're probably right. Yeah. I'm not hearing much else, but that is especially loud. That's weird. I'm gonna ping this backpack for you, pal. <gasps> thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. Here is backpack. Dun, 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 dun. Uh, yeah, ENT Clark points out a very strange fact that this game is 30 bucks on Steam still, which is still. shocking. In the, in the race to the bottom pricing-wise, that is very impressive to hear. And Real Deal 1 is screaming, Hanson, there was literally a backpack in that room. Yes, I know, but I just was looking for a reason to bond with Leo. And if that's a crime, then lock me up, Governor. Ah. Uh -huh. Thanks, man. It means a lot. Hey, thanks. Um, so what do you want to do? You want to go hole up in a bathroom or what? <laughs> Any other options? <laughs> Uh, I'm here to win, so no. <laughs> I need uh, ammo. You got any 762 on you, my good man? No, I do not. Really want to vibe with this AK, but maybe it's not in the cards. Yeah. Oh, backpack level two. Ooh, -hoo. glass coming. <laughs> Thank you. And now you're suggesting that we shouldn't be trying to make a lot of noise. I think you got to go your own way. Okay. And whatever I say we should do, you do the opposite. Okay. And that's the core of all good partnerships. Whatever your significant other wants to do, you have to do the exact opposite so that you can continue getting along. Right. Oh. Ooh, okay. nice med kit. Don't mind if I ding-dong do. He's gonna do it. Ooh, nice grenade. Don't mind if I do. Now, Leo. Oh, is that you, that buddy? Uh, <laughs> yep. uh, Leo, you can't do that. You can't just scare people with the glass shattering. I didn't give you a glass warning. Interesting. Like what you see. Oh, yeah. Uh, so this is an interesting map. It kind of feels like the original map, but is not quite the original map, is my best assessment of the situation. I think that's a fair read. Okay. Oh, I think I already have one of those, but let's go ahead and take this shotgun. Let's assume it's going to be better. Okay. Level two backpack, if you need that for any reason. Got one, thank you so much. Mm -hmm. Got a pan because I forgot that we're playing PUBG currently. All right. 
Well, where's the new home, Leo? Where's the promised land? We can move in deeper or else we can wait here for people to come to us. I kind of want to move in deeper and then hole up. Let's do it. Let's, Let's go to King Nung. Okay. Oh boy. Oh, you're talking like a real, real trek here. This is freaking Lord of the Rings. Yeah. Love it. Love and you're it. my fellow. <laughs> Fellows my. of the ring. <laughs> Just two fellas. <laughs> Duke Faison. Oh, this is a... Oh, was that? Have you seen a car around? No. This is a big, long journey over a wide open area, so I'm a little scared to go on foot. I'm kind of excited about it. Oh, you like that? Yeah. Was Frodo scared? Probably. He did it. Yeah. Continuously. Well, that's kind of part of his charm, I guess. Yeah. I see people 100 million miles away. Okay. Noted. Noted. Behind us. Okay. Close my Windows notification. Okay. Oh, behind us, really? Yeah, super far away. Great. But yeah, if you keep moving, don't run them. All right. Looks like a lovely village across the river. Some place we can really settle down, have a couple kids if you're into that. Right on. You gonna have babies, Leo? Maybe. Yeah, maybe baby. That's kind of the stance. I f yeah. We'll see when the water wars are projected to start. If they could be of serving age by then. Right. I mean, I yeah. I think I think that's a fair discussion. Is like ah, the state of the world. What is it gonna be like to bring more kids into it? But then I always just think like, man, I'm sure hippies in the '60s were having that exact same discussion. And they all. I, I yeah, I think about that too. And I would love to be. Well, I mean, also, they, you know, they were just off by a few years is one way of looking at it. <laughs> well, I guess that's true. Uh, but it, it's, I always think of it like, um, like Interstellar. Good film, but it always made me laugh that, like, we cannot live on this Earth. We need to find some other planet. The planets they go to, it's like, all right, this one's nothing but a tidal wave planet. This one is just uh, one giant rock with a poison creature. It's like, meanwhile, the Earth is still, like, looking habitable. Like, if they would have come across the way Earth exists in that movie in another <laughs> solar system, they would have been like, Eureka! What a miracle, you know? <laughs> well, how do you feel about, like, uh, SpaceX doing exactly what you said, one-to-one, -one, of, like, looking for another planet to settle on when we could probably save Earth if they focused on that? Yeah. Could they save Earth? What would they do? What would they do? What would you do if you had, if you were the the guy who ran SpaceX? Uh, electric train infrastructure in every city. Okay. Every major city. Bring car usage down by 90%. That's fine for us. We're still a fraction compared to China and India, right? Like, so then you I'm saying for the world. For the world. You're a world man. I'm a world man. Hey, guys, get a little of this. Some kind of world man here. Uh, okay, so okay, so electric, so no more cars. Or you just some gonna... more. Some people will need cars, of course. Right, right. But most people, as it is right now, need cars because there's no good infrastructure. Sure. Would you do anything with like cows? Isn't that a whole thing? Cow farting? Yeah. Yeah. Execute them all, one by one. Go down the row. Execution style. Yep. Wow. I am the Burger King, he'd say, before he shot every cow. Okay. <laughs> so that's that's doing something. What else? Yep. What else are the big polluters? What else do you do? Um, well, you know, I think cars are big because of the whole oil industry. Ah, okay. You hear that car? Speaking of which, let's kill our first car. <laughs> okay. Oh, my God. It sounded like a little cute buggy. It did. It's probably not using that much gas, so I don't know if we need to take it out. Oh my god, it look adds at all up. Those, What are all these drops? Look at that. Look at that. Oh. It's like 16 crates dropping. Is, some, is somebody hacking? Is this just what PUBG is now? Oh, Linker points out almonds. Apparently they use water the size of Lake Superior to create one almond over there in California, so that's gotta go. God. You gotta do something about almonds. Okay. Take out big... But how does a company take down another almond company? What's the strategy? 
No, I mean, a company couldn't do it, really. Okay. They could make steps. But I think it's got to come from a... A government who doesn't uh, serve companies. Not to get too political here. What if... <laughs> whoa, whoa, whoa. This guy says these politicians are in the pocket of big money. <laughs> do you... Th okay, what about... Write that down to look up later. <laughs> <laughs> what about, like, if there was... Like, 30 years from now, um, like, AI popped up. And it's like, you idiots cannot get your act together to save planet Earth. It's elect me, and I know how to min-max society. Elect me to be president of the world. Give me all the political power, and I can literally see the matrix when it comes to Congress and the world's Congress and all that fun stuff, and I could actually make some change happen. And this, this AI was just like a cube. It's just a cube. Would you vote for the cube? <laughs> vote cube. Yeah. I don't know if I would tr trust an AI with that. But that's just because of movies and stuff. Do you trust an AI less than you trust random politician? I think they're all no good. No, I hear you. I think it's a compelling offer. Certainly we'd see what the competition was that year. Make sure it's the lesser of the th three evils. Let's hop in this whip. Whoa, whoa. What happened to this whole anti-car agenda we've been going down? <laughs> well, I don't see a train around here, do you? <laughs> no thanks to SpaceX. Just wanted to make a little more noise while we wander into town here. Okay, yeah, yeah. The place to be. Okay, I'm gonna close this door. Somebody points out that the AI was probably made by a human. I guess that's true. And so you gotta wonder, is there like a secret backdoor piece of logic going on there? Like, okay, I made this AI and then once it's installed, I press F3 and suddenly they give me the nukes, which is what I want. Right. Right. Well, that's part of the right. risk, right? A Manchurian candidate, but it's a <laughs> cube. <laughs> It's been a quiet game. Yeah. I'm trying to fight. Yeah, we're here to we're here on Murder Island, not to talk about politics. This does look so similar to the basic map, like some of these buildings. Yeah. Shapes. All right. I'm not seeing a bathroom though. If you see a bathroom, let me know. I gotta I gotta use it before we head out. Yeah, right on. Uh, my sister has two uh -huh. kids, you know, and every time they're about to go on a road trip or something, she goes, okay, big potty before we go, big potty. It always makes me laugh. Like, cool. have you ever had a big potty? It's just like potty's potty, no matter what, right? No. What does that mean, big potty? Big potty is, you know, a euphemism for major dump, I assume. Oh. I'm hearing it for the first time. Oh, interesting. Of which I'd say it varies greatly. Yeah. In size and stature. <laughs> Roll. Okay. I do love this little city. It's really lovely. The circle is on our side, baby. I mean, should we find a place to hole up? Yeah. I mean, may as well wait here and see when the next circle zoops in. What sure. the next circle's going to be. All right. I'm going to hang out on this roof. Okay. Uh, Sam, Rob Snow wants you to stop talking about your huge poops. Um, but it's kind of... Oh, maybe mind your own business. Yeah. <laughs> this stream is private. It'd <laughs> be funny. Maybe, is that a new show plus option? We just insult the chat and dare them to stop looking. Look at all these things dropping, Leo. Roast of the chat. Yeah. I see a car in yonder hill also. There are so many Two crates of them? right there. Three of there. them? I do see three of them. Three cars? <laughs> yeah. Oh, wow. All right, they're Far probably, probably going to get all the goodies. 
Should I take a shot at this hack? I think wait till they push into town, because I think they are going to come this way. Okay, I'm up on the roof. It's a pretty good spot if you want to join me, or you can stay for the classic pincer movement. I do love a pincer. Yeah, maybe we should be up there just so I can revive you, or you can revive me. Okay. That is like opening door sound effect 101. <laughs> yes. <laughs> All right. And I'm closing all the doors so we'll hear them if they come in beneath us. Love it, love it. That's what I like that. Which we definitely will. Having done that, we will hear them now. Mm hmm. Absolutely. All right, I'm going to actually turn up the volume on the game too. And the key to jumping in the menu is to not accidentally hit quit game. We don't want it. That's that. number one. That's number one. Or restart from checkpoint. Right. Resume. Okay. Whew. All right. You might want to get prone so your head's not exposed. If we're just waiting for him. It's okay, Leo. I have a helmet on. Oh, right on. Never mind. What are you, what are you thinking about? Shots from multiple directions. I'm thinking about how I hope everyone's okay. <laughs> everyone's exercising gun safety. <laughs> I like I got that little wiggle so you know I am. Dugga, 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 dugga. Maybe they all just killed each other trying to get those awesome crates. Don't see them super far away. Maybe they're circling the the radius a little more. Yeah, it could be. Maybe they're expecting two god gamers like us. <laughs> you see, there's a new animation where she like scratched her one leg with the other leg while in prone. That's that was a cool one. I like that. King Prometheus says, here's the problem with third person right here. Well, look, if they're going to give it to you, you got to use it. Oh. Is that something? That big old thumb? I'm going to go to the other side of the roof. See what I can see. Okay. I'm just going to poke my head up over the ridge. Maybe they'll think I'm garbage. Ooh, I wonder if we can get on that taller roof. No. I'm game. We can't get distracted. We're so close to the prize. There's only 20 people left. The roof's... That's 10 for each of us. That's right. I'm rounding up, though, buddy. <laughs> Very cool. Thanks. Yeah. Yonder hill is turning into murder hill, as far as I can tell. Ay, ay, ay. Yep. Uh, Real Deal asked, do you prefer first or third person for Battle Royales? I guess I'd prefer third then. It is kind of just another mechanic to think about is like peeking around walls. Mm -hmm. You know, it helps you out as much as it helps enemies out. Oh. So I don't mind it. I wish that if you were on the other side of the wall that you just like got lit up like Sarah Connor and Terminator 2 on the fence type of thing. Yeah. And we could just see everybody that wasn't us get hurt. Wouldn't that be a good game in a moment? <gasps> oh, car. <gasps> I'm coming. I don't know if he's going down this street. Oh, hang on. He actually might be. They're really coming over here. Are they? Oh, he's parking. Yeah, they're getting out. Let's look alive, soldier. Where are they? Uh, 50. Okay. When do you fire? When do you fire? Back guy now. He's behind the truck. Oh. Ah, uh, he knocked me. Okay, I'm just going to pick up some ammo real quick. Oh boy. This is taking longer than oh, I thought. He's throwing a grenade run. Really? Yes. There's no time, Leo. I'm in it for the long haul, buddy. <laughs> <laughs> that was not optional, <laughs> it turns out. <laughs> <laughs> well, we did what we could. We came in eighth, which, you know what? I think that's pretty solid. I think that's pretty gosh darn solid. That's, as always, how you measure success. <laughs> Should we see what these custom games are like? Sure. At least just say hi to the map. Oh, do we get like levels up and stuff? Okay.
right, levels cool. up. Leo, can I be honest with you? Yeah, man. We're like we're so deep in the stream. I feel like I need to admit something. Okay. I don't feel fully confident. I know what a battle pass is, and I've never paid attention to a battle pass in any way, shape, or form. Is that okay? No. <laughs> no, just stay in the line. Just stay on the line, man. <laughs> I feel like it's just been something I've kind of been nodding and smiling, and I guess I've seen something like that, but I've never... Well, describe once... it as you understand it. It's like a rectangle... While we match make. Okay, it's like a rectangle, and you unlock things as you level up and it's just a way to visualize like that <laughs> <laughs> is that is, is it that about time right? limited so the way i understand it and maybe this is idiotic because it is just obviously that's exactly what it is is there are like two rectangles and one of them you get the things that you as you level up you get the things but not as many but if you subscribe to the battle pass or is it just a one purchase thing? Then you get more items. Is that it? Yeah, it's typically a one purchase thing, but you got it. Okay. All right. Well, then I guess I get it. Well, then I guess the lesson is I've, I've never once cared in my life about a battle pass, which I feel like puts me out of, puts me out of commission. Is that a bigger cultural influence that Fortnite has had than the battle royale thing? Is the battle pass? Did they pioneer it? I think so. Huh. Um, maybe. Yeah. History of the battle pass is interesting. Almost as interesting as um, we can't jump into a custom mode, Leo, when we're a team here. Oh, okay. Um, we can do team deathmatch, I presume. I want to do zombie mode, but it looks like there's only one player for zombie mode. Team deathmatch? Also, not really an option. What is going on in arcade? Oh, okay, let's do Team Deathmatch in Arcade. Maybe that'll be a let's thing. Let's do it. Let's try it. Okay, it's first person here. First team to reach 50 kills. It's always fun when a pioneering game mode like PUBG and Battle Royale then just says like, okay, fine. We'll do the old popular game modes. That, <laughs> Isn't uh, that weird? That we're supposed to be the replacing. Evolution. Yeah, but it is what people want. All right. Captain in the chat says Dota 2 had Battle Pass first, I think, but the Fortnite flavor of it is what spread to everything. Gotcha, gotcha. Do you care a lot about Battle Passes, Leo? I care deeply about them. <laughs> it's It's been a very intentional move for me to buy fewer of them. I'll always get into a game and go, yeah, I'm playing it. I'll get the battle pass. And then just stop before I play 10 levels. Siege is like my main game, and I still barely get halfway through that battle pass. Really? Wow. How many? One is exceptionally slow and exceptionally slow. Okay, Leo, we got action at about uh, 35. Hell yeah. I'm here. I'm helping. I'm doing my thing. All right. I, I'm in. I'm in PUBG mode. I gotta get out of that. Jesus Christ! It's louder. It's a war zone. <laughs> oh my god. This mode is louder. <laughs> I'll bring this down a little bit. Yeah, I'm not used to action in PUBG. It's not really my style. No. This is good training for fights, though. Yeah, that is true. All right, I'll come watch you kill people if that's okay. If anybody else like has claimed that spot already, that's fine. You can just let me know. Oh, boy. A lot of a uh, lot of Asian maps is my assessment here. Oh, boy. Well, the game's quite big there, isn't it? I guess that makes sense. Touche, uh, my man. Uh, this is oh. annoying. Even when the volume's low, it's just annoying to listen to. Just the gun sounds are not great. On mobile, this would be awesome. That's right. Oh, I will loot Leo Vader's corpse. Good corpse, Leo. Good corpse. Thanks, man. Oh, boy. Well, you know... Back in our day, this game was kind of a technical mess. And the fact that they can have a first-person mode that kind of works with Deathmatch is impressive for the PUBG I know. <laughs> sure. Yeah, it's interesting coming back to it, and it's still like, what is the... What is PUBG? You know? And it's 
a realistic military battle royale. Seems to be what they're going for, but it still just doesn't have that, that polish. Yeah. Yeah, I bet it'd be interesting if they just tried to rebuild it from the ground up. I know they did that for the map and stuff, but just like the base mechanics. But still, like, it still plays fine to me. I mean, I'm not as much of a shooter kind of sewer as you are, Leo. Like, does it feel clunky to you? Um, not clunky, but not especially interesting either. And I'm surprised that it doesn't have hit indicators still. Right. After all this time. That feels like such a staple of modern shooters. Maybe it is something that just the community would be in an uproar about for some reason. Yeah, it goes against the mill sim flavor of it. Right. To know for sure when you hit someone besides just being able to glimpse the blood popping off them. Alright. Oh, okay. Come on out then, gentlemen. Come on out. Oh, boy. PP19B's on. Okay. <laughs> Isn't that a gun? I don't know. Probably. I don't know. I have a full inventory. Yeah, that's nice. You're like a king. I'm gonna go avenge yeah. you if I have your permission, sir. What's that? I'm gonna go avenge you. Oh, yeah. Okay. Drag one or two guys. Those a little something. Not like that. Okay, okay, okay. Small little map. Great little action. Small map after all. <laughs> lost! Very much lost, seems to be the message. <laughs> do you want to keep playing Surprise! This? <laughs> you lost. Well, if you like. Uh, do you want to keep going with this, sucker? Yeah, I would, or else I'd play one more duos. Okay, yeah, let's try that. Going on a high note. Yeah, please. This loading screen still... Like, it made me laugh that I went to the Steam store for PUBG and looked at this sucker. And, like, the first screenshot they have is just about, like, that black-pink uh, collaboration. Is that the name of that thing? Yeah. That band. Uh, which is weird when that's, like, their go-to screenshot here. It's just showing off that whole thing. Uh, okay, two-man squad, third person. So we can select the game mode to some extent. Oh, so I can go to two-man squad, first person. Would you want to try that? Oh, is that where the more hardcore gamers are going to be? Yeah, probably. Let's go for uh, the weak-ass gamers, please. Although I can't imagine more hardcore gamers than what we found. In our own Gamers hearts. of harder core. Yeah. Uh, King Prometheus says, the real question is when Hansen's going to return to Escape from Tarkov. Oh, boy. I don't know, King Prometheus. I don't know if I could ever be cool enough to return to that one. Um, how's that going? How's Escape from Tarkov going? I assume it's still popular, but I am still waiting on somebody to rip them off. Like, it's crazy that, that Fortnite hasn't tried to go for an Escape from Tarkov mode. It seems right there. But, you know, they got their class. Oh, I gotta actually tell the game I'm ready. That seems important. Tell us what the game know. That's right. That's right. Allegedly, Battlefield 2042's final mode is going to be Tarkov-inspired. That'd be really allegedly interesting. I wonder where you heard that, King Prometheus. Innocent uh, until proven guilty. Yeah. Yeah. That'd John's... be cool. That'd be a good fit. I think. Yeah. Oh, I think do people be. like? Would people like a cartoony Tarkov, or do they like the the realistic feel of it? I think there's always room in the game industry. Did you ready up, Leo? Yeah. Oh. We're preparing. Oh, sorry. Um, oh, wait. No, no, we're good. <laughs> um, I think there's always room for something cartoonier and faster in the game industry, no matter what the mode is. Somebody could make a cartoonier and faster warrior wear, and it would find a market, right? Okay. That's my theory. So I say yes. How would you make a cartoonier warrior wear? Um, you know, <laughs> I'm just spitballing <laughs> ideas here, Leo. I'm not a game designer, but I'd say you'd probably have to... Golly, you know... Uh... <laughs> It'd be like a different character every frame, and it'd be like 30 yeah. frames, and it would just be like a different cartoon character every frame. Okay. And again, I'm not designing it. I'm just throwing ideas out there. But hey, look at this, Leo. Pay attention. Uh, Tor Torbomb. No, Torbomb X 
just threw a big sub away on Twitch. Thank you, Torbomb. Thank you, Torbomb. Appreciate it, Torbomb. I want a bean, Hanson, right in the head for you. Plunk. I will sneak up on Leo and he will not see me coming. Oh, Where'd Hanson no. go? Shh, 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 shh. He doesn't know. He doesn't know that I'm right freaking here. I'd love Don't. if you went to a perfect neck snap <laughs> animation. <laughs> Oh, what are all these other people doing? Yeah, I don't think anyone else is having very much fun in the lobby. They're all just dancing? <laughs> Hang on. PUBG just got good. There's some sort of boy band breaking out in the lobby. Well, <laughs> yo, why can't we be that cool, man? Oh! We will someday. Thanks, I'll try for the big sub on Twitch! Appreciate it. Uh -huh. Oh, 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 uh, it's interesting though, because you know, a faster, cartoonier version isn't an automatic success. If you look at something like Hyperscape. I guess that's true. Which I would say is one of the faster battle royales out there. Yeah, but I mean, Fortnite already kind of beat him to that punch, right? Uh, in terms of the faster, cartoonier, so maybe it's the first. But not fastest, cartooniest. I think that's right. I think that's right. Right. Hmm. Everybody looks unique. There's a lot of. A lot Harley of beautiful Quinn's snowflakes here. here. Really? Where? I want to see her. Over here. I like your films. I like your films. I like your films. I like your films. Come here. It also says Jessica23. Is that from Looney uh, Space Jam 2? No. No. Yeah, absolutely not. Have you seen that second Space Jam movie, Leo? No. I really think you should watch it. It is. Yeah. It is nasty. It is corporate nasty. If that's a genre you're yeah. into, I think it's it's worth watching just to be like, what is happening in the state of the film industry these days? That's the thing, is I have HBO Max, but I still feel like I should steal that. Yeah. You know? <laughs> I think that's right. I think that's the right message to send. If you just want an evening of like jaw dropping, what are you idiots doing? It's Space Jam 2. I okay. recommend it fully. Um, let's go to the Abbey. In honor of uh, Miss Russell. Today we salute you. That's right. Didn't she move to LA? Did she? Yeah. Or maybe she moved cool. to whatever this map is called. Okay. This is LA right now. Yeah. That's why we need SpaceX to help us out. Because they didn't execute the cows. That's right. They didn't choke them out with almonds. Two birds, baby. <laughs> Oh, this is I do love that this game has a free look when you hold alt. More games need a free look. For sure. Look at that huge tower over there. Is that a rocket ship? Whoa, that's cool. That's cool. Uh, okay, Leo, looks like we got some gentlemen joining us on this little adventure. We got some gentlemen joiners on R6. Gentlemen uh, joiners for people. Right, everybody in the chat, uh, let us know if you're happy to see these gentlemen or if you'd like us to take care of them. If you They're going them. inside the abbey. In Side the Abbey. From above. So I see we work. Oh, you're nowhere near me. No, I'm not good at floating in the sky. <laughs> <laughs> but I do have a gun, so if you need that, yeah, I'm your boy. Bring it here, my man. <laughs> oh, to you. Okay, I'll send it over to you one bullet at a time. Here we go. Oh, Grant, joining us in the chat, says, you boys look hungry for chicken dinner. Hell yeah, Grant. Num num, eat up. Now Grant, I don't believe ever really played PUBG, but he has played more Blackout and Warzone than I believe anybody on Earth. And if y'all want to see somebody good at the game, at some point, Grant, you should try streaming Warzone. Unless that game is still just infested with a, yeah. oh crap, uh, oh. cheaters. Thanks Josh for the big sub. Oh, crossbow Leo. We can really go hunting no. here. Leo! I got down by a level 500 guy for the fourth time this stream. Are you kidding me? Can I avenge you with a crossbow at least? You can do your best. Okay. Get the ammo, people are screaming. Get the ammo. Why? <laughs> Great. Yeah, where, where was the <laughs> ammo for that one, team? Come on. All right. Uh, yeah, sorry for the sub being so loud, Duke Faison. All right, Leo, I think that was a pretty thorough look at the return of PUBG. It's back, baby, and there's no it's way back. around it. Is it back? Why did we put this on the poll? Can I have time? <laughs> <laughs> it's way too late to ask that, dude. Um, because uh, I think on the podcast last week, at some point, PUBG came up? Oh, because we were talking about... 
We were talking about something. Uh, we're talking about Brendan Green leaving. Right. But that came up because of something else of PUBG. And then I think I just said, hey, we should put PUBG on the new show plus poll. And you remember that's, that's when everybody joke. watching us live at the backstage past here, they all erupted and said, huzzah, do it, make it so. Remember? Ringing a bell now. Yeah, yeah, there's a lot of cheering. Um, all right, everybody, that's it for the return of PUBG. You can vote for this next week by going to patreon.com slash minmax with two wins, and we'll keep on rolling these out. If we come and next back, week, we'd be playing with the community if it That's wins. right. Big, huge community game. We'll get that full thing rolling. So if you want to play with us, if you want to stream snipe the hell out of us, whatever you'd like to do, you can head over to patreon.com slash minmax with two wins and support us there. We'd appreciate it. Otherwise, uh, just a heads up, we're recording uh, the MinMax Show podcast a little bit late this week. We're doing it on Thursday after the big PlayStation Showcase stream, which seems like... It's fair to get expectations up for this thing, Leo. I think it's I think it's going to be good. They're they're positioning it and not hedging any bets with how they're talking about it. So that means it's going to be God of War. And if it was just that, I'd be in love. And it seems like it's going to be more than that. So I'm I'm excited, Leo. Yeah, Goddess of War. Who can say? So subscribe to the Next Show podcast on your favorite podcast app, and we'll be there in the future, talking to you through the app. <laughs> Leo, thank you for joining me on this grand adventure, man. Hey, my pleasure. Uh, also, Trivia Tower, uh, Duke Faison is asking when that's happening. The plan right now, I need to double check, but the plan right now is for that to happen uh, this Monday. So Monday, September 13th at 8 p.m. Central is going to be the next episode of Trivia Tower. Uh, we have a very special co-host. That should be a good time, so please look forward to that. And this is going to be a funky one, Leo. We're going to try out a little something. You know, like how we were playing... Uh, duos here for PUBG. I, I remember that. What if you brought that buddy system philosophy to Trivia Tower? Oh. We'll be explaining soon. We'll run it all down with the details and explain oh. exactly how that works. But for now, I will say, if you know a friend who's very good at trivia, video game trivia, you might want to recruit them to join. All right. Thanks so much for watching, everybody. We'll see you next time for New Show Plus. Bye. Bye. Every week, we let Patreon supporters choose which new show we create with New Show Plus. Should we create another episode of the show you just watched? Check out the biggest new game release? Get into Sea of Thieves? Create an exercise show? It is your call. So thanks to everybody who subscribes on YouTube or supports us over on Patreon. MinMax exists because of you. As always, if you enjoy MinMax content, any help telling a friend is appreciated.